A heroic father of two who cracked open his skull while trying to save his son is fighting for his life in intensive care, as doctors can't believe he survived the fall. Brad Lewis, 42, was at a friend's house in Church Point in Sydney's north on August 4 when his eight-year-old son Oscar playfully shot a few Nerf gun bullets at him. The bullets missed and went over the first floor balcony, and Oscar ran to see where they went, losing his balance. Mr. Lewis lunged at his son to save him, but they ended up both tumbling towards the concrete below. During the fall, Mr. Lewis pinned Oscar to his chest and curled around him in order to take the brunt of the impact, taking the full force of it on his head. Mr. Lewis's friend Bo Worthington was the first to respond, and recalled Brad's first words after the fall were, Are the kids okay? Don't let them see me like this, don't let me die mate. Mr. Robinson said he was forced to hold his friend's skull together in his hands. Oscar was concussed, fractured his skull and had bruising on the brain, but has since been released from hospital. Mr. Lewis sustained major head and neck injuries, cracking his skull open, bruising his brain, fracturing his C6 vertebrae. His recovery is expected to last for at least six months, and a friend of the family has started a GoFundMe page to raise money as his wife Suz has taken leave from her job to care for him. Mr. Lewis and his son were treated at the scene by paramedics and a care flight team. Oscar, the eldest of two boys, was taken to Royal North Shore Hospital by car after being tended to by road medics. Mr. Lewis, a former army officer, was flown to the Royal North Shore Hospital in a serious condition. Care flight specialist doctor and critical care paramedic treated the man at the scene for serious head injuries, a care flight spokesman said. Mr. Worthington said the accident happened in front of multiple families who had gathered at his house for lunch. I've known Brad all my life and he does everything for his family. He's a tough guy, he told News Corp, to see him like that was a freak of nature.